I've already applied my moisturizer and primer. Starting off, I'm taking a white eyeliner pencil. You can actually use brown or cream color or whatever color as long you can see the lines that you will make. I line the side of my face by referring to several photos in the internet. The lines don't have to be perfect, it's just good enough so you can see it. To draw the nose and eye sockets, I used the black color body and face painting palette by Eye Magic Cosmetics. The color is not really intense but good enough as a base color. I draw an almost square shape around my eyes, just like drawing sunglasses frame if it makes sense. But I make the edges a bit rounder and the inner edge a bit outward so that it looks sad and creepy at the same time. For the nose, I start by drawing two parallel lines. Then I connect one of the end with a curve. Next, I draw another curve to the tip of my nose. It's kind of hard to explain precisely, but I'm sure you'll understand by seeing it what I'm doing now. Then fill the sockets and negative sides in with a black color. As I said before, the black body paint color is not as intense and dark as I want it to be. So I add black gel liner to darken it up. Then I pack lots of black pressed eyeshadow powder to sort of lock the gel liner if it makes sense. Time for white color. I use the same body and face paint palette by Eye Magic Cosmetics. I add several layers of the white paint and blend it with foundation brush so that it doesn't look chalky. If you wonder why I don't start this makeup by filling my whole face with white paint first, actually I did. But when I started filling in black color, it blends with the white to create vibrant grayish color and I can't cover it even if I apply tons of black gel liner. So this is the best method I could come up with. As you can see, some part of my cheeks are not filled in with the black color yet. That's because I want to draw the teeth and fill in the lower parts first so that I can easily see where I should fill in my cheeks later. Before I start filling the lower part of my face with the white paint, I draw a set of teeth. This taking quite some time because I want to make sure they are not too small that you can see them or too big that will make me look like a bunny. I mean, I want this look to be creepy, not cute. Once they're done, I can easily color the rest of my jaws and chin with white paint. Next, I use white eyeshadow to lock the color in. Then 
Now it's time to fill in the cheeks. I use the same black eyeshadow and filled in my cheeks, upper and lower gums carefully so that I don't ruin the teeth shape that I've just made. Next, I'm taking a gel liner and very fine detailed brush to draw tiny, tiny, tiny gaps between each tooth. Again, this is not easy to explain because I basically freehand drawing the lines and fill in the gaps between upper and lower teeth. I also add more black liner and black eyeshadow on the gums to give it more contrast. To make the teeth look more ugly and rotten, I add brown colors at the roots of each tooth. I use fluffy small brush to smooth out the colors, then I drag some of the colors outwards to give more realistic bone-ish look. Then I start shading out here and there and add some cracks all over my face. Finally, I line my waterlines with black pencil eyeliner and reapply the black eyeshadow around my eyes to complete the looks. And the look is done. Thank you so so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!